Okay, thank you. So we're going to make the stand. And to make the stand, you take an... <laughs> dog, and, dog and radio show today. <laughs> um, we're going to take an 8-inch piece of chipboard by 2 inches, scored 1 inch on each end with little tabs to make a T on each end. And now we're going to attach everything. And then when we attach it to the bottom of the box, it'll curve naturally, and then we'll put our face plates in. Uh-oh. Grab your dog. <laughs> you notice how I said it was her dog now? <laughs> Whenever so, she does I'm just going to put these little... To. I'm going to attach it with these little strips. Good girl. Yeah, she is a good girl. She is a good girl. I'm going to cut four of these. Oh, she's Except for when she comes and stays in my house. <laughs> yeah, she hasn't done anything too bad here. We've been vigilant, though. <laughs> I know, honey. Did you have a good time? Oh, Let's say hi to everybody. Come here. Oh. I can hear her panting. I know. She, it's so funny because she knows. I mean, she knows when I'm on. I know. I'm not holding on. Oh, that's cute. There's your Gabby. There's Gabby. There she is. There she is. Can you say hi to everybody? Did you get some water? Did she get some water? No, she's still oh, okay. There's my baby. She just ran in right to you. I know. There she is. Okay, let's get some water. Let's get some water. All right. Where were we? <laughs> we were taping. Taping and gluing. We're doing the bait. That's right. So I'm just, like I said, I'm just putting them in at a 45 degree angle. And you hit the record button? I did. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I actually did. So I'm going to use my little burnisher. I love these Teflon bone folders too. I don't know if you guys, this one and this one. I got them from scrap a -a -doo. I guess other people have them too, but that's where I got mine. Love them. Everybody's saying hi to Gabby. Aw. Gabby knows when I'm streaming. She knows when I'm in a hangout. It's so funny. Yeah, we did have a power outage. Oh, you did? Yeah, because all the <gasps> clocks are off. Just before we went on, you guys, the light above us went out, and it's really dark in here without that light, and we're like... Oh my gosh, now what do we do? And then I came right, I came back on. Yeah, I gotta get my glasses and reset the clock. It's like, what else can happen? Well, this didn't happen when we were on the air. No. What time is it, Beth? Do you know? One o'clock, Mom. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Mom, you're not allowed to talk anymore. No. <laughs> Next thing you know, she's going to ask me what I want for lunch. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's so funny. Told you it wasn't me. <laughs> I can't wish you. No, to be fair, Jonna said don't ask Darcy questions and things when she's doing that so that, you know, she doesn't get distracted. She didn't say she couldn't talk. But it was so funny when Mom said that. You have to admit, it was hilarious. There's always something funny going on here. Even unintentional <laughs> fun. Yeah. So, you know me, I'm the trimmer. <laughs> Jean calls herself the procrastinator. I call myself the trimmer. So I'm going to get this on here once I put it up, and I'm probably going to trim those little corners off. Just saying. <laughs> Okay, so once we get our little strips on and that's holding everything, we can go ahead and stick this down.
and uh, you can line it too. I probably won't today for the sake of time, but I that's what I would do is I would put a strip that comes up and does the inside. I mean, I don't know. We'll see. We're going pretty at a pretty good clip. Okay. So I'm gonna glue. I'm gonna glue and tape it so that it will stick right away. What are you doing? What's she doing? Mm -hmm. <laughs> she do? Oh, okay. Maybe so silly. Yes, so silly. Beautiful day out. And the pressure when you glue this will be on the ends. That's where the curve really is. And so uh, if you put some good, like, score tape, something sticky and glue and everything else there, then you shouldn't have to hold it. I, I had to sit and kind of hold it yesterday because I didn't have clamps. But something else I forgot. But you could probably clamp it. I had clamps. Why didn't you ask me? I said I did. I know. You didn't tell me you had them. Well, you didn't that ask. Was <laughs> that was everybody's stocking stuffer from you this year. Clamps. <laughs> Woohoo! We got clamps, baby. Do you need some? Um, yeah, I don't Jess, I think actually so. Like, I don't think I can clamp this. I'm honest. making an ice resin necklace. Yep. Should I show them the one you made me? Yeah, you can show. Well, sure. do you want to take it off? No, no, I don't have it on. I have oh. yours on and her shirt. Well, I can show that one. She picked, yeah, she picked mine. She's wearing, she's like, well, which one should I wear? I'm like, you should wear mine. <laughs> <laughs> but I was watching Artie Dar, who watched uh, B Sue B on YouTube do altered keys. So I made my mom an altered key for Christmas, and I put it in her stocking. Beautiful. It's a it's a soft green with rhinestones and a um, piece of a I think a vintage earring. Oh yeah, oh that is pretty. Yeah, Jonna made mom. She soldered it. Italia. She soldered a pendant on Italy. You can describe it, John. This is um a, a crystal we got there too. Uh, I can't really because um I'm on I'm not, I have a delay and I'm looking at Darcy's key. Okay, well that's oh. all right. I just I just showed it and then you can talk about it when you see it there. Darcy's at mom's. I'm at mom's. Yeah, I'm at my mom's. Yeah, it's wonderful. Okay, so we're gonna stick this down. Get some glue going. Pick up this. Um, what was the name of the altered key place? They want to know. I think, it, is Dar still here? I think it was B Sue B. Letter B, then Sue, and then a B. YouTube. But Artie Dar did one, did bunch too. And that's where I saw it. And um, you basically. Did you take that back, Mom? What? The key. Mm -hmm. You basically um, wire wrap it with stones or beads or you can do a design. Yeah. So hers I just did really simply, but it's a soft. It looks like I used a green and a, I used a green and a cream. Oops. So I painted it a green and cream and then I wrapped it and put rhinestone trim and then a piece of an earring on it. And the back is pretty too, the way you wrapped it. I just did a little coil yeah. and then I wrapped it. So, oh. But Dar did some gorgeous ones too. Woo, pretty. Dar was in here. Yeah, she's probably arting. She likes to watch an art. She's amazing. Yep. She's on after us tonight. Like <gasps> oh, that's right. She's on at like 6 or 6.30 or something. It's usually around oh. 6, yep. And it's called... Oh, we can sit and eat chicken. And... <laughs> oh, we are going to sit and eat fried chicken. And watch Artie. Duh. Mom's fried chicken, breaded oh, chicken, okay. and, and I watch Artie. <laughs> I have my, my best friend from high school is visiting. And it's our first month this this month, so um, I'm going to pick her up, and I won't be at our stream, but I'll have to watch the recording. She records, though. Uh-huh. But anyway, we're going to out to dinner. That'll be nice. Yeah, that'll be nice. 
Yes, we're going to go to Winter Park. Okay, so all I did was I stuck it down, glue and tape. Oh yeah, that works really well, you guys. If you put the score tape right on the end, that'll really hold it. And then just glue the rest so it comes out nice and smooth and gets good coverage. That's how I would do it. I am loving this glue, I have to tell you. I'm having like a love affair with this glue. Okay. So now for the front, all we're gonna do is glue this on. Oh, and it does, it looks like I don't have to trim anything. Yay, okay, awesome. So, but this is the part I may have to hold. Maybe I'll just use a little bit of tape. I don't have the smaller. I own it, but I don't have it with me. I love the 3 8 I use it all the time. That's my favorite. Okay. So here we go. I'm just going to have to trim it because I didn't have anything smaller. Is it nice out, Mom? Is it nice out? Mm-hmm. Good. Beautiful. Okay. And we'll glue. So good to see the sun again. <laughs> I'm telling you, it was brutally cold. I I, I went out and ran some errands for her because I was like, you there's no way you should be out in that. It was yeah. really bad. Yeah, she was a good girl. Yes, she was. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna do a tiny little bead right over here. I always think it's funny how people talk to their animals because I mean, I do too. Like, they don't, like, they don't, like, you change your voice. Mm hmm <laughs> But it's so funny because, like, you don't, you only change your voice for your dog. It's your puppy yeah. voice. Oh, here it is. Speak in your puppy voice. I have all my things on your blanket, don't I? She wants to lay down. Oh. I'm going to put all this away. Hey, Mom, grab a pen and a notepad because you're going to pick a number in a little bit. Okay. Right now? Yep. Oh, all right. Hold on. Thank you. Hold on. Hold it. Hold on. I just had the pen. Oh, cute. That is too stinking cute. Oh, that is cute. So there's that. And we'll do the back. And we'll do the sides. <laughs> and we'll be done with that part. Yay. Do you want me to write the numbers? You're um, going to make up a number. Oh, I'm going to make up a number. Yeah. Between what and what, Jonna? Um, well, we have 34 in the thing. So do like 1 to 50. Okay. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll send, um, you're going to get a set of these adorable enamel hearts. Oh, and if you win this, you still are eligible to win the clock radio. We don't make people not, you know, and it, unless you don't want to win it, and then just, you don't have to, you don't have to play, but you can certainly win both if you want. So the little cute brads, the enamel hearts, and I'll give you some of my paper too, because I have a ton. She wants me to write a number out. Yeah, you're gonna pick a number between one and fifty. But don't tell anybody. I'm not. She, yeah. Secret. She's not on the camera anyway right now, so it's good. Yeah, I wanted those little heart enamels. They look cute. They are. But I I sent them on. Oh, you didn't take one? I thought you took one. No, oh. I was being good. I didn't take one. <laughs> I didn't take one of the Brad packs. Though. Yeah, I noticed that. Because they had daisies in them. I had to have the daisies. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, I could have just pulled the daisies out and sent you the pack. 
That's okay. There were plenty in that pack for, you know, what I needed, so. And I'm just butting that up right against the edge. Just like that. And it, it holds because it's got that reinforcement on the inside. So. Your camera, is it dark Do you hear Is that why you're coming in? Oh, is that Ollie? Is that yeah. Ollie? Oh, Ollie's a good boy. Hi, Oliver. Is that Gloria's mom? Hi, oh, sweetheart. Hey, sweetheart. Let this me take like, you for a walk. <laughs> I'm telling you what, if you've never been to our show before, <laughs> this is what it's like. Just saying. Uh. I packed so much stuff, Jonna. When I got here, I was just like, I packed everything I could think of, but I still forgot stuff. Okay, so um, I'll type out the rule because I know there's a lag. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's a dorb. That is a dorbs. I know I have this really bad habit, so I'm going to apologize right now, but I have a really bad habit of thinking things are really cute that I made, like I say it. I don't mean to sound vain. It's actually a just more surprise than anything that it comes together. <laughs> Cause you know, you never know. All right. Yep. So now I'm just gonna put the end pieces on. Cut out a little. And those are gonna be two by one. Just leave it there for now. Uh, yes, of course we dress our dogs up, Jess. Are you kidding me? Oh yeah. In fact, mom is an enabler. She got she got Oliver the cutest little raincoat last year. <laughs> Doesn't everybody? I thought everybody dressed up their dogs. Perfect. Perfect. I'm just going to make two of these for both of my legs. One by two. One inch by two inch. She saved poor dogs. They love it. They love it. I don't know if they love it, but oh, that's so cute. Just <sighs> use a water food. Yeah. So we are, some of you are going, we're going to Steampunk Soiree in July. And we're going to see Gentleman Jim. Miss you, Jim and Cesar and Barb and Kay. We all went to Italy together. And um, Catherine, who I still say Catherine from the Scrap Beach. Old habits die hard. Catherine Scraps. And Kathy Orda, who we just uh, can't wait to see her. Adore. She's adorable. She is. She is awesome. Oh, and by the way, I just wanted to let you guys know, I don't know how many of you know this, but she has a digital kit club now. So if you saw anything that she makes that you just you really want to make and you weren't able to because you didn't have the kit club, you can now buy the digital form. So the videos, tutorials, and um, pattern, whatever whatever she has for the kit, you can buy now, and then you just use your stash, your stashorama, which I thought was great. So Paper Phenomenon is her website, and this is an unsolicited plug. But I just thought it was great. <laughs> Unsolicited plug. <laughs> we have to preface that. We have to preface that. <laughs> we are not being sponsored by anyone <laughs> anywhere. 
hey, when I, if I see something I like, I'm, you know, I'll let people Promote know. It. I will let people know. Yeah. Yes. I'm just. We love Kathy. We had a blast with her. We <sighs> love Carol. We had a blast with Carol at CHA. Yeah. So. We, we just, and of course, we love Jim and Caesar. Oh, my God. Yeah. I just can't. Yeah. Jim and Cesar. I miss them so much. We love Jim and Cesar. Yeah. 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 We love Jim and and uh Jerry Ann, she was so much fun. Yeah. We had fun with her. Yeah. Jerry Ann's scrapbooking show. She's on Eastern too. She's not here right now, but mm -mm. And I got to meet Laura Dennison and I showed her how to use her phone <laughs> to stream. That was fun. Yeah, that was fun. And Marion Smith, I mean we met some we met like there were some pretty cool people at CHA doing um doing their thing. It was fun. Okay, so I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna trim this because the object, the object of this whole game is that it has to stand evenly. <laughs> oh, thanks, Carol. That was fun. Okay. Yes. Oh my gosh, Jonna, you're gonna be so proud of me. La la. Okay, we ready to pick a number? Mom, are we ready? Yes. Boy, we, are, we are moving right along. This oh, is great. Oh, well, good. Okay, you're going to pick, I wrote out all the rules. So 1 to 50, one number after I type go. I know there's a lag. So you're going to notice that the, um, that the chat's going to pause because after everybody puts their numbers in, I'll put stop. I'll type the word stop in, and then I'm going to um, pause the chat, find out who put the number in after mom shows it, and then we'll, you know, we can announce it that way. So wait for me to type in go, and wait for me to type in stop. 1 to 50 without going over one number. So I'm going to wait for a little bit of a lag so you hear the rules, even though I typed it all in. Bye, Colleen. Again, I'm late, but if you're watching the recording, bye. I love her. I have to tell on Colleen. The, she had a beautiful scrap room. They moved, and she still has a beautiful area. But in her old area, she had a shelf very high up. And her husband was so cute. He videotaped it while she talked. They were adorable. And uh, she had a very high shelf in that room, and it had body parts on it. It oh. had heads mannequin oh, oh. mannequin like heads and hands and uh, just and, and we said look at that wall of body parts and she goes i did not realize i had that because <laughs> <laughs> it was so high up well because she just it was a display you know oh. she had it she goes i never thought of it as being body parts <laughs> oh my god okay i'm gonna type in go did you write your number Okay, don't show. <laughs> hey, Margaret Ann. Oh, Hi, Jesus. Mickey. They're going to be mowing the lawns today. Oh, They're going to be mowing the lawn. Hey, Linda. It wouldn't be our show if there wasn't some <laughs> annoying background sound. Yeah, note how because I'm not streaming, my neighbor's not doing their lawn. I'm telling you, Jonna. <laughs> I'm telling I know. I'm telling you. That's what it is. Yeah. That's really cute. This one's coming out. It's coming out good. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think we're... I'm going to type in. Oh shoot. <laughs> oh shoot. I'll let Mark, not that Martha in. <laughs> oh, you know Martha. Oh. Okay, 
I gotta stop the chat. Pausing the chat. Okay, um. Mom, what was your number? Where can you put it there? Yeah. <laughs> 18! Okie dokie! I want to be 18 again. Mm. Oh, that's a little too young. <laughs> We're still making mistakes at that age. Okay, um, Loriana so far is 17. Loriana was 17. Gotta see if there is an 18. Yep. Okay, congratulations. Yay. Send Jonna your Addy. Oh, and we'll get that out to you. Yeah. Closest without going over. Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Pris. That's okay. Um, Miss Pris, Miss P, what happened was um, remember uh, Sunset Carol for, was on a roll there for a while and she was winning everything. So. Yeah, everybody has their day. Yeah. And not only that, Sherry's in here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you beat out Sherry. That's a miracle. Aww. No, we, Sherry was on a roll there, too. It was pretty funny. It was. We love Sherry. Okay, so. Yay. Congratulations! So I'll get these out to you. Of course, you'll get the full set of the brads. But you get the cute daisies. We love them. They look like little enamel daisies. And then the little hearts and then some papers. So you'll be able to make something with it. Yes. Okay. So now, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to work on the top. And this might get dramatic. <laughs> John is probably going O M. Should I leave the room? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I don't I think I have to go use the restroom. I'll be back in a little bit. Oh, you brat. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is um where I have to glue down these. <laughs> and my clock face and everything else. So yeah, it'll be fraught with drama. Just saying. It will be fraught with drama. So now we're going to work on the front of the clock. And the clock, here I go, I got to scroll back up. Sorry, guys. Hi, Diane. Okay. So on the front, excuse me, I put, I put a piece of paper around, you know, the, ugh, sorry guys, so annoying. Okay, um, piece of paper on top of solid cardstock, and then, and this was from this paper line from the Vintage Collector, and these circles were as well. The inside ones where the volume control and the tuner are, and this one needs a brad in the middle, I didn't put one in, but, um, and little, it's little clock hands, because I, I don't, let me put a real clock in that one. But anyway, that would be kind of cool. So um, this is all from the paper collection. And then these are, this is a printable that I'm making available. So if you wanted to print out the little clock parts, you can. So we're going to put, uh, this is um, a punch. So I put this on too, just to give it some texture. And this is that glitter Mod Podge. It's sparkly. <laughs> So that's what we're doing now on this one. So <clears throat> I went with the paper line. I'm using this cute little plaid that I cut in a diamond pattern to put on that one side. And then, and it's a little bit pastel, so. And then um, I'm going to put the this stuff on and this this is the EK success punch and I think it's called modern square 
don't know where the punch went. I kept it out so I could show you. Mm. Let's see it. Mm -mm. Did, you, did you take it? No. <laughs> oh, oh, it's back fine. of you. I'm so bad. Mom doesn't take my stuff. No. I'm a good girl. Let's see, it's this one. I love this punch. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. it's EK Success. So if anybody knows the real name, let me know. But that's what I thought it was. Something like Modern Square, Modern Grid. I don't know. Yeah, I think it was called Modern Square. I love it. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm going to put these down first. And I think the easiest way to do it, let me get all my clock parts out of the way here. I think the easiest way to do it is to do it this way so that you can make sure it lines up. And then it doesn't really matter with, where it ends over here because that's where this is going to go. So you have a little bit of wiggle room. That's going to be right there. And so I did it so that you didn't see a lot of this edge on the top and on the bottom because it looked kind of funky because there was only like the one piece at the top here, you, you know, was kind of empty and then it had the line. So I sort of lined it up so that you didn't really get that part. Oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. John, are you feel right at home? There's lawn going on out there. <laughs> oh, it's going to really get noisy. I'm sorry. It's not that loud. You can't, I can hardly hear it. Okay. I have to be right back because Oliver's whining. Again? He might need some water in his bowl. What is wrong with that thing? Aww, <laughs> it's metal. What's wrong with that thing? <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> That's so rude. Okay. So... I always start, I, I line them up like that, so like I said, you don't get a lot of that line. And then I lined this particular pattern up so that it was offset, so that um, the boxes are off by half. Let's see, that one goes that way, that one goes that way. This one will go, I'll go back this way. Like that. Because we can trim all that off. You know me. I trim. What can I say? Okay, but see, that's the trick. So, we'll get these two in the middle going first. And I always just pick one and just start with it. And I think... I think it's just going to end up going like that. Those look like they're pretty much in the middle. They don't have to be totally centered, but you don't want it to make you crazy. That's the trick. Just do it so it doesn't make you crazy. <laughs> That's only advice. And I'm going to use the uh, quick dry because I want it to hold, and I just want to be able to use little dots. And this is the fine tip one. I saved. Somebody, thank goodness, told us that the um that they were coming out with you know the wider tip and they said but save your old one because it'll still work on the bottle so i was like so excited because i ran to the trash and i grabbed the one that i had just thrown out <laughs> i was like all happy i think i'm just going to do it and flip it over Don't answer it. It's Porter. Don't answer it. Okay. Porter will call you back if you watch this. Uh, well, I'll go in the kitchen. Good grief. What else? What else is going to happen today? I told her, she said, I can't turn off my phone because, you know, in case there's an emergency. I'm like, I'm here if there's an emergency. So I'm like... All right, so I'm just doing little dots. If you had a glue pen, which I don't have, I'd use a glue pen, but this will work. Uh, 
Okay. So that's gonna get enough on there to stick it to the You could use your Zyron too. Yeah, I don't have it. But yes, you could. You could lay all four of these down. Wouldn't that be that would have been so cheating? Because not everyone has one. But yeah, I could have laid all four of them down. <laughs> And put it, like, that would have been great. Just make sure that that's going to be off that grid. And it is. Yay. Okay. Cool. Let me pick this up before it gets glue everywhere. Okay. So you get your first one down and... You hope it's even, which I don't <laughs> look slightly off, but uh. and then just build out from there. So I'm gonna turn it sideways so I can see what I'm doing. Because I'm alternating. Okay. Oops. But yeah, it would have, it's faster if you have a Xyron just to use the Xyron. Because you could, you could even line them up. And then you could even stick them down as one big piece, which would be awesomeness. Did, I wonder if she told him we're going to the flea market. I'm just kidding. Porter, are you feeling like doing decoupage again? <laughs> oh, yeah. So funny. <laughs> oh, is it Porter? Yeah. Oh. I know. I was like, oh, I don't want to interrupt him, but we talked yesterday about calling him and, um, you know, having him over. So that's our nephew. He's so fun. We love him. He's on his way back from Charleston. Oh, okay. He did a service there this morning. Good. Well, I'm still gluing. Nothing's changed since okay. you left. <laughs> Can I get you anything? Mm -mm. I'm good. Okay. I'm going to trim some of this off. You can use any punch really for this. You just want a repetitive pattern. You can use um, a strip die. Uh, there's some really cute ones out now from that are kind of retro. So don't limit yourself if you just use what you have. I have to glue that back on. Just let that dry and then I'll cut that off. So mom's doing something in there. I'm sorry. <laughs> trying to be quiet. <laughs> That's mom trying to be quiet. <laughs> Okay, that's going to be good. This is going to look good. Okay. Oh. Okay, Blissful, bye. Bye. I think it's so nice of you guys. I think it's great for you all to hang out with us today. Oh, yeah. I'm sure that... I hope the weather's better for you guys as well as, you know, as us. As it is for us.
That's it. Mm. Little dots, little dots all over. And again, like I said, I'm just um, alternating just to make it look a little more interesting. Uh, this one I'm going to do here, about there. Yeah, well, the lawn people probably weren't able to get out here either because of the weather, right? So. That's so. it. That's why they're here on Saturday. Mm-hmm. Now, you could use another, you know, piece of pattern paper here, too. You don't have to do the die-cut punch thing, but I just really liked the texture. Mm-hmm. No, thanks. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll hold it up as soon as it's ready. Sophie's in here. Hey, Sophie. Sophie, did you see what we're making today? Can you hear mom eating? No. <laughs> I didn't think so. <laughs> I'm just teasing her. <laughs> now you won't let mom eat. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, she is eat. She has to eat. Ah. I think you should drink something before you get I will. I got all that coffee over there that I didn't get Will to drink. Warm it? No, I'll just drink it. Cause I don't want to get a headache later, and that's what will happen. Okay, so I'm just gonna hit these little end pieces. Mm. Cute, cute, cute. Okay, so that's all you do there. I don't know if you can see, I'll hold it for a second to see if the contrast pops up. Because it's such a light green with a light peach that it's hard to see. Okay. So now I'll put this piece down. Gabby's eating something too. They're all crunching over here. <laughs> <laughs> Gabby's got a carrot. <laughs> Mom's got crackers and tuna. That's so funny. All of won't touch any of the stuff that Gabby eats. <laughs> I know. Gabby's favorite treat is uh, green beans. She loves them. And it's like, it's so easy. You just go buy a bag of frozen green beans. that picky she would be picky with the whole food like if she didn't like the food at all yeah she wouldn't eat it but okay so now we're gonna start working on the clock we got this little clock face and we got our little dials Let me 
see. I think I'll work on the clock face first. Well, that's drying. Hey, Donna. I'm just I'm just saying hi. I'm sorry if I'm missing people. Um, but if I look up, it's nice to see you. And Donna Cobb, nice to see you too. Who? Pam. Pamela. Pamela, are you the one? Are you going to Steampunk Soiree? I think that might be the Pam, Jonna. Ah. Cool. <laughs> All right, so I'm just going to get these glue in so they dry while we're doing our thing. Okay, good. Well, nice to meet you, Pamela. I guess I'll be meeting you in person. Awesome. We're going to have so much fun. Yep. Yeah, that'll be awesome. That's our trip this year, really. Right, Jonna? That's our... We try to do one trip together, that, at least one. Well, we did CHA. We did LA. That was really fun. But I was sick, but it was fun. Okay, so now I did these little legs, on, or little, what do you call these? Hands. <laughs> legs. <laughs> I made these little hands for the little clock. And what I did, because it's modern, you know, it's retro, so the hands in, at that time were usually straight or at least very simple. So I did straight hands and then I used um, a small hole punch. Where's my little, I had it out. <laughs> I know. I pulled everything out so I could show you now I can't find anything. It, and it's here somewhere. But anyway, so I punched a little hole punch, a little hole with just that little like half inch punch, I think it is. And I glued it, I glued the little hands on that so that that has something for the brad to grab onto. So that's how I did that. And I'm just gonna put them on. Uh, yep, um, UK's next year. Yes, happy Diane. Next year, April 2015 is the UK. So anybody who wants to go, um, if you would email us at scrappycampersisters at gmail.com, um, we'll just kind of keep you updated about that trip. And then maybe we can like plan to meet somewhere and stuff like that. If y'all want to, if some people want to go and they don't want to travel by themselves, you know, find you. Buddy. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just cutting some acetate. Now, if I had just a regular piece of acetate, like a transparency, I would put my clock hands in and I would put my brad in so that they the clock hands are inside the transparency. And because I have um I just have laminating stuff here. It's, this is going to have to be stuck down. So the time's always going to be the same time. <laughs> but either way, if you guys want to do it either way, that's great. Or, you know, use a clock kit. That would be really fun. Make it a working clock. Oops. Keeps hitting that. Um, my bone folder keeps knocking it over. It's back there. There we go. Okay, so I'm just going to get these down. Oh, it doesn't matter, I guess, what color. And like I said, this is a printable that we're going to make as part of the pattern. So so you don't have to research a retro clock <laughs> faces. <laughs> See, I'm a giver. What can I say?
Oh, you can see that. I guess I need to scroll back up. Okay, so we got that going. We'll get our little clear stuff going. We are, we're zipping right along here. This is awesome. I'm just gonna pop that down. in there. <laughs> no squeezing. No what? Oh, okay. Linda said that. Well, I wonder if I should say it on. No, it's okay. Or... Don't don't do it. No, we're just done. Um, it's we... about the UK. Okay. Well, we can talk about that some other time. Okay, I think I'm gonna glue this down. I need to get a brad in there. Oh, I guess what I brought. Is Eileen here if she watches the recording? Mm, I don't think she came in. Da da da. Is it this? Guess. It's a big chomp. <laughs> the big chomp. The big bite. What am I called? The big... It's the pig chomp. The pig bite. I love no. my pig bite. It goes where no one has ever gone before. I'll say that for it. Okay, we're going to put a little brad in there. Let's see what color we want to use. These brads are so great. I think I'm going to use the little diamond that absorbs. Oh, but see, it takes up the whole space. I'm going to use a smaller <laughs> one. Hey, Darcy does know how to set an eyelet. I would just like you to know. I do know how to set an eyelet. I'm good at eyelets. I showed her how to do it. I kept smashing mine, but then I found out that they were upside down. Vicky! Speaking of chomper. <laughs> hey, Vicky! Hey, Vicky! Oh, I was writing Vicky's name down on the list and I put, hey, Vicky. Oh my gosh. Okay. That's her new name. Hey, Vicky. Hey, Vicky! See, so I just stuck a little brat in there for an accent. Oh, Scorpio Girl wants you to show up, show the uh, project one more time. Where's okay. Nana? Hey, Mom, Vanna White. Oh, um, I'll oh, do it. She can do it. It's right here. Oh, here's my wallow glue. I have an abundance of glue riches today. This is it. We're making a retro clock radio. A little stand. A little stand. And it has a mini album that goes in the back that's based on a clipboard design. So it's a nice, thick piece of chipboard which actually forms the back of the radio clock radio and then everything is um attached with these beaded binding rings that I'm going to show you how to make it's a partial ring it goes around and then it the wire gets twisted and fastened in the back and then covered with paper so that's it okay so right now I'm just working on the front which, like I was telling John, I could possibly be fraught with drama, but it seems to be going okay. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and glue this, the clock face down. I've got a little silver frame that's going to go around it that I painted with silver. It's just chipboard and silver paint. So get this puppy down. Let's put it right side up, shall we? <laughs> that would have been bad, y'all.
I like glue because I can move it around. That's cute. So far, I did so far. I'm just gonna put the frame on it. I'm sorry for the, it, the pastel colors. They're very light and it's very pretty, but it is hard to see on the screen. And uh, so we'll post pictures to the blog so you can see what it's supposed to look like. What it's supposed to look like. Let me get some of this stuff. Um, okay, let me just say something really quick. Uh, they want to know where we can get patterns and kits. Okay, first of all, we do not do kits, mm -hmm. but um, we do have like our patterns and principles and things, but currently right now we don't have them up and available because we're moving everything to a website just to make it easier where everything's all in one place because we do everything on the blog, but then we've got like stuff like out there where you can download and stuff. So all of it's been temporarily pulled down so we can put it on a website and we have a lot, all our patterns are, um, if there's anything you see that you want, if you just email me, I can send it to you. Yeah, we'll send it to you in the interim, but in the meantime, yeah, there's we're... no charge. You just, we don't do that. So, but anyway, so that's kind of what's going on. So in the interim, if you want one, if you just email me at uh, Scrappy Camber Sisters at gmail .com, I can send you a link or whatever. Well, Darcy will send one for the clock radio mm -hmm. when she gets home. Yeah, because I have to. I have to make some modifications. I have to make some modifications to the ever-changing measurements. <laughs> but, you know, it goes with the territory for me. Well, we just decided you can get a lot more storage with the, um, with the website, and you can we can put everything there. Like our video, it's, all, it's just going to make life so much easier for, well, me, because I do a lot of that. But mm -hmm. it just makes it a lot easier, so that's what we're doing. Oh, yay! Yeah, I know the picture's really clear, Darcy. Good. I think it's her high speed, you know. That high speed internet? Yeah. Okay, this is a little fussy because it's the frame for the clock and it's in four pieces. That's why it's like. Uh, but once I get it lined up the way I want, it'll be okay. Did you put the laminate on? Mm-hmm. I'm going to pop that on. Shoot, and then once I get this done, we're on to the mini. This is so exciting. Why don't we just go to a campground where you can rent a camper? 
Yeah, patchy. And then you don't have to. The patchy campground right on the water. Pay every time. I'm going to trim that one, I think. Aw, think so. There. There's our little frame for the clock. It's silver. It's chipboard that I painted silver. Now we'll put the... Oh, I want to get the brads on these. I really like that blue flower. I just don't know how it's going to look. <laughs> I guess if camp, camping, if you can camp in your car, that's fine. Yay, Jess. <laughs> oh, that's so cute, Darcy. Thanks. This line yes, is really I said sweet. It because our stream, Penny, <laughs> and I can say absorbs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Dee Dee. She tries. She tries to give us manners. <laughs> KOA has internet. John has already researched all of this. <laughs> oh, Vaughn loves your little radio. Thank she you. Even Stinking cute and absorbs in our streams. This is not Dweedy. We our, love we, we love our Dweedy. We do. I don't want it to look crooked. Oh, I wonder how Boo's doing at her cheerleading thing. I don't mm. have. I gotta get my phones in the other room. I don't know, but Jana certainly spent years trailing her daughter at that stuff. Oh my gosh, yes. And I was one of the so-called cheer moms, so... <laughs> Jonna was I, one of those cheer moms. I was. I had to do all, like, their, you know, do the other kids' hair. And hey, Jonna, remember? We had to do their makeup that time. Yeah, when they went to Universal, yeah. they competed at Universal. I yes. used to be a makeup artist, so I got enlisted. <laughs> Oh, give girl. Give girl. <laughs> Sorry, Vicky. I have a new word called luscious. I call it all luscious. I thought you but called it scrumptious. scrumptious. I don't know. Luscious and scrumptious. I'm going to do... I don't know. Ooh. Somebody's taking their motor home to Hilton Head. Nice. No, I did not push my daughter into doing any of that. Oh, she, no. She wanted it. She, she it was my oldest daughter, and she's like a princess. And anything she's, that was frilly, sparkly, mm -mm. pink or purple, had mm -mm. any, all that. girl. She could do her lipstick at two years old perfectly <laughs> without going outside of her lips, without oh. a mirror. I mean, she had that, she had that lip gloss down. Oops. That was pretty fancy. She was cute. She was my girl. I mean, she would sit there. She loved, she'd ask me to curl her hair, to braid her hair. I mean, she'd come and get me. I mean, she just, but have a wrinkle in her sock or a bump on her hair. I mean, her hair, remember? Her hair, she would make me brush it like totally smooth. Mm -hmm. Like she didn't have any like bumps yeah. in her ponytails. Oh yeah. my gosh. <laughs> And then she went through the curly, kinky hair stage where she wanted big hair. So I used to have to braid it at night, kind of damp when it was damp. And then she'd get up in the morning and we'd undo it. And then it'd be all Oh, cute. Hair. She had great thick hair. Yes, natural born diva. But she was always like that. And then the younger one, Jerrica, she was a tomboy. Oh my gosh, Jerrica was like total opposite. She she would she'd be the one that would go in the bathroom, turn the shower on, come out and act like she had like splashed a little bit of water on her on her hair because she didn't want to take a 
take the time out. It wasn't that she didn't like taking a shower. She just didn't want to take the time out for being busy. She'd rather be on her skateboard or on her bike or... Oh, gosh. That's cute. Thanks. Okay, here we go. I love this glue. I want to marry him. <laughs> vintage photo is going to be jello because I'm, I'm married to vintage photo. But according to Jess, he cheats. Uh, what's new? Because <laughs> I used to say, I love vintage photo. Vintage photo is my favorite ink. Love it. Want to marry it. Okay, so I'm, I'm putting the top on now. I'm putting that. So the cool thing is, you know, you can make that whole clock face with very little stress and then just glue the whole thing on the front. How easy is that? <laughs> Jess is in love with worn lipstick. <laughs> okay, we won't go there. Because that one cheats too, probably, right? Worn lipstick. Worn lipstick wear. So that's it right there. That's the little clock radio. I hope you can see that. I don't know if you can see the detail, but I'm trying to hold it maybe there just a little so you can kind of no glare. So that's it. It's easy. I think you'll enjoy making it. It's not hard. Which, I mean, really shouldn't be a criteria because anything can be made with enough time. But it's nice to know that it just kind of goes together too, you know. Okay, so what we'll do is I'm going to take a little break. And what do you think? I don't know, five, Yay. ten minutes. And uh, I'm going to clear this out, put some, put my stuff down for the mini, and we'll we'll start working on that. Can I have it? This one? I thought, yeah, I thought I'd ask before Dar did. <laughs> I was going to, actually, I was going to give this one to Mom, but... I'll make you one. Yay. I'll make so you a mini beautiful. one. I'll make you a mini one that you can put uh, marshmallow. No. <laughs> That's beautiful. You can put. Um, I love it. Fireballs. Mm. <laughs> Jawbreakers in. <laughs> no. But anyway, yeah. That's, it's cute. I mean, I if you guys try this paper, it's Chicken Itty Crafts, Heidi Sumble. Wonderful. It, it's really nice. I mean, it really came together easily, I have to say. Okay, so I'm going to BRB, and I don't have a BRB. <gasps> Ooh, I have a B. B. <laughs> Here we go. Give me, a, give me, give me a B. Give me a B. I got an oh, R. Oh, that was nice that, that Joy told you all to come here. That was really sweet. Who said that? Really? Yeah. We have some new Zelda? people. Is, um, oh, that's nice. Is Laura on today? Because I don't want to... Yeah, she usually comes on at 9 in the morning her time. Uh-oh. I think she just kind of started that because I used to watch her all the time and it was always late at night. I used to watch... No, she did. She does Saturdays too, but I think she for our time she used to be on at 3 our time. But I know she has, you know, her kids are getting older and have all kinds of activities and I think she tries to schedule things around her family too, so... She um, is making some great stuff. Oh my gosh, yeah, don't let us stop you. If you need to, you guys need to pop over and see what Laura's doing. Please do. We joke about it. We'll still be here. <clears throat> there's a, um, there's a page. A page? Yeah, in this stuff, the stuff that you had before. Where is it? That, that pad? Did you put it over there? Yeah, give me that. No, that's not it. Where's the no. other one? Wait a minute, there's one back there. Mm -hmm. okay. That's okay. not it either. It was, huh? the one you, it was the one you had before. I know. Mm. It's that, that family. No, that's not it there? No, I'm not talking about that. Oh. Links are open, guys, if you want to if you have a craft yeah. channel. That's the one we're using now. Craft what was the other pad you handed me and then and I said, no, we don't need it. Not, no. In the chat so people can find you. 
Honey. Oh, okay. That's okay. That's fine. Honey. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, so I'm just going to get set up. I was looking for my R, but we can't find it. I have an R. <laughs> oh, okay. I knew, she would. I knew she didn't regularly do Saturday because I watch her. <laughs> and then I was having problems until I couldn't watch her for a long time, Laura, because um, I had, uh, she streams in high depth, and I, had, I hadn't upgraded any of my systems, and so I was always stuck with the blue circle, and it used to be so frustrating, so I used to just watch her. Uh, her recordings all the time, but oh my gosh, her projects are amazing. If you've never seen Laura Dennis's project in real life, you're missing out because I saw them at CHA and yeah. they were amazing. Like her pet shop, amazing. Her uh, uh, the Winter Fairy, house. Winter Fairy House. Yes, oh the Winter Fairy House, amazing. So thanks, Donna. Regular classes are Wednesday and Friday. Yep. Yeah. I've been following her almost since the beginning. She was like the first one I followed on Ustream. That's how I found everybody else. She um, She's making a transportation series pretty soon. Laura is at some point. And... No, thank you. I want to do the Mom's airplane dad i know she's doing a train a plane and a yacht Ooh. and i'm gonna do the yacht and then it was so funny because i was talking to jonna and i was like i'm gonna do the yacht if i have time i never have time i have so many albums and i so little time anyway see so here's my brb <laughs> and um <clears throat> but she's doing a, a yacht and i was like yeah you know because my my ex-husband was an oceanographer and i ended up in a lot of big industrial ports around the world and I was in 40 knot winds in the North Sea once jumping from one vessel to the next as they were going up and down and oh, oh I did that one lots time, of drama remember? when I came to stay with you yep lots of drama so I I was, I said to Jonna yeah I'm gonna do that with all those pictures from those days you know when I was traveling I was going all that and she goes oh I thought you were gonna do it from Stonington because I lived in Stonington, Connecticut. It was a pretty little shipping town on the Connecticut coast. And I was like, oh, yeah, I could do that. <laughs> but, yeah, so we'll be doing that one. Oh, and the other thing is <clears throat> we did a, um, I don't, for all you new people or people who didn't follow us from the beginning, we, um, we did a vintage, or like a vintage camper. And mm -hmm. Auntie Maggie, who I think she left already, but Auntie Maggie did um, uh, Laura Dennison's truck. Yeah. And she put it in front of our camper mini. Yeah. Oh, my God, it's adorable. Her heartbeat. I know. So now we want to do the truck. I know. Now I have to do this. Now i got to make the truck. But it's. Fun. Really cute with the camper. But all of our all of our stuff's down right now because we're in the middle of making a we're doing a website. The website's up, but we're trying to get everything digitized and we're going back to our early like things that we you know allowed you guys to download and stuff. And we're trying to um, take them from hand drawn because my early patterns were all hand drawn. So Darcy's been going through taking our hand drawings and actually doing them like computerized so that when you download it, it'll be like good, really nice patterns. Not hard to follow. Yeah. That's probably why this one, because this is like one of the ones I did that way. One of the first earlier ones. One of the first ones I've done that with. Well, you did our my house. Oh, that's right. Christmas house with it. Yeah. So alligator books. That's an interesting name. What is it? Alligator book is the person's name in the chat. Cute. I'm, I'm outing you. I don't know. <laughs> Aww. Yeah. Hopefully alligator book is not working. But anyway. So this is yeah. what we're making. I need this convertible to pull my camper. Like my real camper, Zippy, or like my camper, Mini? Carol! Sunset Carol. Oh, cool. Hey, Carol. Okay, I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop this because the next one will be the mini album, okay? Stop oh, the recording. Wait, so we're staying here. She's just 